don't know if you guys can hear that but guys this is rain this is not any type of this is heavy rain in november somebody explain to me what's going on in the world global warming is real y'all because when we were growing up this was not a thing you don't get rain this heavy in november but guys welcome back to my channel i'm very hungry i think i just need to eat before i can talk to y'all properly so let me go fix something to eat I'm so hungry. I'm waiting for my potatoes. They're still boiling before I can pan fry them. Norma is on her way here though. That's good news. She hasn't been here since this house was finished. Like, I remember when I moved, she came all the way from Enugu to help me move. And then she went back. But at that point, a lot of things were not done. And she's finally on her way here. She just landed. So I'm making food for both of us, to be honest. She's texting me saying she's very hungry. So it's just going to be pan fried potatoes um some salad like by the way i got french dressing a lot of you are asking me what i thought about the italian dressing that i got and guys like it wasn't my first time actually ever getting italian dressing if you've been watching me you know that i like italian dressing that particular brand however it was my first time trying that brand and i don't necessarily I compared to the other brand that i like the other one is better i got french dressing though from the brand that i like it was much cheaper like 1000 something and i'm going to tell you guys like what i think because i don't think i've ever tried french dressing before anyways and i'm also making eggs to go with our potatoes okay it's a healthy breakfast to have hmm? okay I don't know why I completely forgot to turn on the light. picking this up but guys these potatoes look so good i just want them to brown a little bit more and i'll be done but yeah i love the way it's looking so far okay these potatoes are done they look the way i want them to swing out i can leave them on to get a bit browner but i feel like this is fine okay so let me work on the egg now I forgot to give you this. Mm -hmm. I need to get it's so dark in here. No. Yeah. Mm. Do you like it? Okay, very good. Guys, this is my second plate. This is why it's not good to 
eat when you're extremely hungry because brah this is so good though like the salad and by the way french dressing is actually not bad i still prefer italian dressing but this is not as bad i prefer this to the version of italian dressing that i got but the potatoes eggs mm. this one is here like pressing her phone but mm. anyways yeah hi guys okay let me see if i should increase the iso a little bit is that too bright i think that this is good hey guys so this is the next day okay you guys saw me yesterday i've had quite a bit to do stuff that i just could not vlog guys but i want to talk to you guys really quickly i have a big pr but two good pr packages to unbox actually i'm really excited about them and i'm also waiting for Nama to come back because she came to lagos for something so she's going to do that so i'm waiting for her to come back home and then we'll figure out what we're doing this evening but i want to say a very big thank you to the sponsors of today's video i want to say a very big thank you to jace finder for sponsoring today's video so jace finder is a next generation tracking software that uses bluetooth enabled tracking to find the location of any synced device i've talked to you guys about jace finder before last year i think after or just before i went to ghana i talked to you guys and i I still use Jace Finder till date. It's a very, very good tracking device. I even have more than one of it right now. So it's this cute little button tablet thing here. It looks really nice. I love the design of it. It has Jace Finder written on the back. If you think that you've lost an item that has your Jace Finder attached to it, all you have to do is to open the Jace Finder app. It's available on the Android, Google Play Store, or the iOS App Store. You can attach this to literally anything, but I always personally attach my Jace Finders to my keys because that's the one thing that I know that I tend to lose, okay? If you're like a guy and you don't carry handbags, you can easily attach this to your wallet. So your phone, you can attach it to your phone case. Like a lot of phone cases actually make provisions for you to kind of attach a string. You can also attach this to like your pet's toy, your children's toys. If you also have have an animal that tends to disappear like a dog or a cat you can also just attach your jace finder to the color of the animal and then when you click on find it starts beeping and you're able to locate where the animal is okay so if you use an android device you're going to be able to attach about four to six j trackers to your android jace finder app and if you use an ios app or an ios device you're going to be able to attach about 6 to 12 j trackers to your device okay so there are two different types of j trackers there is the starter versatile finder which sells for 8500 and that one covers a range of 10 meters right and there is the pro premium finder which sells for 12500 and this one covers a range of 12 meters okay so the range is slightly wider than the starter they're both very good it just depends on what your budget is with that i'll just say quickly that compared to the price of other smart trackers in the market these are quite affordable and considering the fact that the prices of everything has been going wugu waga these are similar prices to what i shared with you guys last year they haven't doubled or tripled like you get with a lot of things so i think that the prices are really really good and decent for smart tags so the starter and the pro they are both remote controlled from the app okay the pro especially which is what i have it comes with a replaceable battery and this replaceable battery can last you one whole year so the pro comes with this type of battery the pro 2 is waterproof just fyi this is waterproof so you can fall into water and you pick it up immediately without worrying about the consequences it will survive that okay to buy this you all you have to do is to go to the website that is going to appear on the screen and guys setting this up is very very easy all you have to do is download the app okay and then it asks you if you have a device to set up or pair and then if you click on next and say yes like you know click on next you have to just long press this there's a button on your jace finder once you long press it it makes a sound so it comes on and then once a device moves to the next page it just shows you all the jace finders within range or it tells you that there's a jace finder within range you select it and then that's it like it's so easy you do it in like under five minutes it's very 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 quick okay so they are on facebook instagram and twitter and their handle is at jace finder so look them off there ask them questions if you want to on there i'm also going to leave like contact information for them in the description box there's an email address and a phone number that you can call okay let me show you guys quickly again how this works i use this on each floor like i said i have about three floors in my house actually i am on the top floor so what i do is if i'm looking for something and i'm not quite sure what floor is on i take my phone to each floor so i start out from the top and i just press find on the app and then 
wait to see if it will beep on this floor if it doesn't i just go downstairs wait to see if it will beep on that floor if it doesn't i go to the last floor and just wait to see if it will beep on that floor let me leave this key really quickly in my bedroom right come back here for example and press find and you guys will see okay so this is me trying to find my keys what i'm going to do now is press find you guys can hear that beeping right this is in another room or maybe i should close the doors okay it has stopped so some people i'm sure are wondering how doors interfere so i'm going to do that again it's still making noise regardless can you guys hear it's still beeping regardless it stopped now as i got closer i'll just press it again it starts and I put it in this drawer here. Can you hear? Amazing. So guys, check the description box for all the additional information that you will need on Jay's Finder. Again, thank you Jay's Finder for sponsoring today's video. Guys, this is the box that I was talking about unboxing. I had to switch to my phone because this is such a massive box and it's just going to be easier for me to unbox it with my phone okay it's big you guys can see this table okay the box itself is wider this is not a table this is a chest of drawers like so this is for beauty west africa and this is an invite basically there's an event at landmark center tomorrow which i will be attending okay tomorrow there's a big box massive massive box here Hold on. this kind of got shoot around a bit um, so we're just going to go through what we have in here. There's a La Roche Posse mug. This is, I already have this, but this is very good. Look, actually, this is the Essay Smoothing Cream. By the time this video goes up, my skincare routine video should have gone up. This sunscreen is literally my holy grail. It's what I use and I'm almost up, right? So this is a new one. Thank you. Okay. Perfect. And what's this? Triple action, anti-scratching, anti-dry skin flare-ups, immediate soothing. This, uh, I've actually not heard a lot about, but it's also suitable for atopic eczema prone skin. It's a triple action balm, anti-scratching, anti-dry skin flare-ups, um, immediate soothing. It's good for newborns. So this is interesting. There's a flyer here for the sunscreen which is literally the best sunscreen I've ever used for my face in this life. And um, there's a notepad here. Guys, I love notepads. Actually, two notepads in here. I love notepads. I want to make sure that they are actually notepads. Yeah, these are notepads, cute notepads. Okay, love. So one is CeraVe and one is La Roche. There's a pen here. Wherever there is a pen, there is a notepad. And there's a hydrating cleanser for normal to dry skin. It's crazy because I have two of these now. And I actually have combination to oily skin. So what I'll do is I'll probably give this away. And, oh, guys, I love this for my body. The last skincare routine, I'm uh, not skincare routine, my shower routine video, which if you have not seen, I'm going to have it linked in the description box. I use this. I love this. It's a very, very good moisturizing lotion. So these are quite a lot of... Okay, so I have... An extra pen here this is a very nice pr package Oof, very nice invite to think that this is actually an invite and not even a pr package thank you laroche and sarah v this is good so i'm back to using my camera because yeah i couldn't use this to unbox that pr package it was massive or that invite so i have some candles here so basically i have something that was delivered to me via dhl and this is from a brand called Elua Studio. I can smell something, so I'm hoping that everything is intact and nothing has spilled here, to be honest, because it looks like customs open this, which is standard. They do this a lot, a lot. This is PR. So it says Elua Studio. Can you guys see? This brand is by a creator called Lee. She's Cameroonian, but I know she lives in Senegal at the moment. And she, it's called Spirited Pursuits on Instagram. In case you don't know her, she does a lot of travel and lifestyle content. So I'm gonna to try to open this nicely. Okay, so like this. Oh, I have a 
handwritten note here. It says, Dear Demand. I've been a fan for so long. Oh, thank you, Lee. I love it when I get like handwritten notes. Like, this one was so well done. There's a card that basically gives instructions for the products, how to store, how to use. These are scented, and the smell I'm actually. I'm perceiving are just the scented candles. Guys, this is a PR package, like a lot of effort and thought has gone into this. There's a cloth here. You guys can see that this is tied, so I'm gonna... These are wrapped so carefully, like... Oh, guys, oh my god. Oof, jeez. Oh my god. Guys, look at this candle. Look at how gorgeous. Look at the detailing on it. Look at this. <clears throat> gorgeous. This will look so good in my living room. It will also look so good uh, just behind me here where I have the candles and stuff set up for filming. Oh, guys, it smells amazing. Let me open another one. I'm going to leave the ISO like this while I unwrap. Guys, this smells so good. Guys, look at this. It's also just how good these things smell. Hey! Lee, these are gorgeous. Oh my gosh. So there are three candles in total here for me. Guys, look at the detailing on this. Look at how gorgeous this is. It smells so good. This one has a very freshy scent to it so good guys yeah so these were shipped from dakar senegal they ship here they ship to lagos nigeria in case you're interested in this so so gorgeous these will work really great in some of the spaces that i have thank you so much lee thank you i'm gonna take cute pictures of these so guys i'm, I'm waiting for norma when she comes back i'll probably continue with vlogging i have a couple of other things i have to do things that are not necessarily exciting but yeah I'm also going to have their website linked in the description box. Guys, I am ready and I put my wig on. This is the next day, by the way. So I'm doing a panel for Nectar Beauty Hub, Beauty West Africa. So I'm going to be on the panel. We're going to, I'm going to go live with the dermatologist. It's going to be really exciting. I'm wearing this bag from Brandon Blackwood and these shoes, which are kind of the same color from Aldo. This two piece from ASOS. I've had it for a very long time. I'm just happy that the waist is actually like looking good because for a long time, the waist was just hanging there. So good, okay. I really love it. So I'll see you guys when I get there. So join us or two. I'll be going live on my Instagram. At on Instagram. So we'll go live on there. If you do not want to come by the booth, I'm not even sure you're asleep. But if you want to watch the live, just share my Instagram right now. Like I share. And you'll see us kind of talk about this more. Okay? Guys, I just came back home. Let me even reduce this because I think it's too bright. But 
just got back home um, I've taken off my high heeled shoes and I've not eaten anything since morning not good okay going out to eat with a normal now and after that I'll come back and do a couple of things and yeah but today was really good I met a lot of people today it was just all around good so let me go and find food I wasn't looking at the lens I was looking at the viewfinder sorry guys but I'm hungry these meals are so cute. Mwah, come on, me na obere madam. Can you imagine my my mom called this babe and is calling me obere madam, a homie. Mommy, this mommy call me, call me in the video's voice. Guys, this mirror up here is so cute. I am so hungry. I've not had anything to eat all day, so I'm in and out of here. Thank you. So we ordered crab tacos. You're going to eat a bit? So crab tacos, um, I got guava dream. This was the drink I got the last time that I was here. I really liked it. And then number, what did you get? Virgin strawberry. So this is virgin strawberry. Okay. Okay. I'm so hungry guys. Nothing since morning. Thank you. So this is my pasta. No, I got um, roast with mashed potatoes and I got pasta. This is their seafood pasta. So hungry. I've already started drinking, like I've, I've drank a lot. So this looks good. I think I'm still going to dig into that. I want to try her food. It looks good. Guys, I'm hoping that the lighting isn't that bad. I wanted to talk to you guys really quickly. Oh, hold on. I forgot some things in the office. I'm going to be ending this vlog today. I just wanted to have a quick chat with you guys before. I had a bunch of things I thought that I could do this week, like I kind of planned and scheduled, but this week has been so busy for me, guys. It's not even funny. It's been so busy. I've had a lot of work and a lot of deadlines to meet. And Norma is also visiting you guys new, but then she was also here for work or she's also here for work. So there's been a lot of work for her in between. So we'll just kind of catch up at random hours during the day she's leaving tomorrow however i am sad i know the couple of things i wanted us to do but she has to go back to work you know but she'll come back again hopefully by the grace of god one thing i wanted to say before i continue is that guys the vlog that i had up last week was hands down one of my favorite vlogs i have ever posted if you've not watched it i'm going to have it linked in the description box and hopefully maybe pops up somewhere on the screen but that was such a good vlog it was packed with a lot of activity you see how weeks can tend to go like i don't have a lot of things that took me outdoors this week last week i had a lot of things that took me outdoors so yeah if you've not watched that vlog go watch it it was one of those ones that i was very very proud of like at the end of it it was a very very good vlog um very quickly like let's talk about beauty west africa guys this was my first time going for that it's an annual thing and i feel like the times it's happened in the past two or three years i've always had things during that period that kind of made it impossible for me to attend but i was very happy that i attended and i actually attended with norma you, probably, you guys probably didn't see her in the clips but she was there norma was there and it was also like very helpful because norma is a pharmacist so she saw a lot of interesting like unique brands like it's one of those places you see a lot of brands even from outside the country they come to exhibit and they're looking for distributors and retailers to sell their products and you can also buy things at a discounted price there so i got a couple of things just unbox really quickly the first bag i have here is from summer beauty i wanted to show you guys really quickly just before i head out and this is a sculpting gel i was told that this one is very very good so i'm excited to see how much i like that there is a protein rich deep conditioner here okay this is a nigerian brand first thing i'm going to say is that i just love the quality of the packaging feels very foreign feels stronger okay than some foreign things the two things i'm holding right now they're made in the usa but they have a lot of like african ingredients because it's by african people and their products cater to different hair types so i'm just really excited i can't really say much about them now until maybe i come back to you guys later and say oh i really like this there's a shampoo that i also got so i went to their stand and they gave me this bag full of products there's a magic growth serum i don't know if you guys have noticed but 
I've not been doing my hair. When I say doing my hair, like I've stopped like braiding and stuff. My edges are finally beginning to grow back because I did a lot of like protective styling this year to the point that like it was largely braiding and cornrows in between. And it's wild to me sometimes how they say if you want your hair to grow, go back to protective styling. I remember that when I was in Dubai, I had cornrows in and I was wearing wigs throughout that period. I still felt like my edges suffered some serious okay i feel like i did braids largely and it wasn't like anything dramatic or anything but i just wanted my hair to grow so it was i got to this place where it was like do you want your hair long or do you want your edges which one do you want because i think a lot of protective styling someone correct me if i'm wrong i'm wrong is that a lot of things we consider protective styling for women of color actually is heavily focused on length retention and it's like you're retaining length but you're edges are suffering you know so i am oh guys the, the the packaging like the packaging of all of this is really good this is a leave-in conditioner i know i already talked to you guys about like a spray leave-in conditioner that i was using i love spray leave-in conditioners for relaxed because my hair is relaxed but then again guys i'm also like relaxing like two times a year like i don't relax my hair like that like i do relax that only about two times a year okay so my hair has a lot of new growth right now we'll get to that later but I have a goodie bag here from La Roche Posay, and they were one of the reasons why I actually went to the event in the first place. So they kind of threw a couple of things because I have a lot of their products already. Funny enough, before I was even contacted for the panel and the demo live that I did for them, I had a lot of La Roche pro products, and they were trying to give me so much. I was like, no, you guys shouldn't give me a lot. I actually just want things that I could actually use because it's so funny that I had done that skincare routine video and I talked about all these products like if you've also not seen my skincare routine video i'd highly recommend that you go check it out it's a very good video it kind of explains a lot of the things that i've done or incorporated into my regimen of uh, regimen regimen that has improved my skin and just kind of like my skin feels a lot more soft a lot more supple not as dry uh, or as dull my breakouts have also like literally minimized like I haven't broken out in two weeks. I don't even want to jinx it, but I just haven't done any of the products that I'm using are largely to blame, okay? So they were trying to give me a lot, but uh, I was also like, I just want things that I could actually use. I don't want too much. So if I want something new, I'll go check it out. So I got this. So this is the La Roche Anthelios um, Invisible Spray. So if you watch my skincare routine video, you saw me talking about the invisible fluid. I'm almost even, I have like two backup, like, about three, yeah, I think I have about, okay, two spare invisible fluids. And I think in the PR package I also received last week, I got an extra one. Guys, that is the best SPF I've ever used on my face, hands down. It's not heavy on the SPF smell. It does not leave a cast, you know. In the video that I did, I talked about the Bondi Sands um, SPF for my body. But then they also gave me this to try. So this is for the body. So when I was telling them how much I love the invisible fluid and... I was not saying that I used another SPF for my body. They were like, oh, you need to try, you know, you need to try this one, which is like fair enough. And they were like, oh, I need to try this. And this is the spray. To be honest, I didn't even, but this is supposed to be like a bigger version of the fluid and you're able to apply this like all over your body. This one even like almost has like a nice scent. How do I explain it? Like it has, it's it's it almost like it's, it's almost like it's not SPF. There's something a bit like mm, clean, like about the scent you get with this one, which is very very good. This was also given to me. So this is a uh, guys. I have so many La Roche and CeraVe products. I think I'm going to do a giveaway soon. Okay, just this plus what I even received when I got the PR package. Like I think I have to give away stuff. I I will I will I will arrange a giveaway, guys. Maybe something leading up to Christmas. This is a cleanser, okay? And this is very, very good for people who have like dry, maybe I think sensitive prone skin, okay? Which I don't have. So this is probably one of the things I'll give in my giveaway. Norma is literally also waiting to raid my stash because Norma has actually normal dry skin. I have combination to oily skin. So they gave me three serums to try, okay? So when I was grabbing these serums, like there was also a fourth one, the hyaluronic acid, hyaluronic. Guys, that word is so hard for me to pronounce, but I've tried that before. And what actually happened with the La Roche 
um, hyaluronic acid serum for me because I was using it last year around the time I was in London where the weather was even dry and I did notice some bumps so it kind of broke me out but what that does is that it gives you intense hydration so I feel like it was so moisturized and that maybe my skin just couldn't handle it everybody responds to products differently so I even told them that I've done one that because I've tried it before so they were like okay if you've not tried that and since you've already also told us that you really like the Effaclar range that there's an Effaclar serum which has um, salicylic acid um, glycolic acid and niacinamide in it and this is anti-imperfection anti-max daily peeling i don't really know what the daily peeling means but if you guys watch my video you know that i really talked about the effaclar moisturizer i love that a lot for moisturizing my skin and i love the effaclar foaming wash for cleaning my face that's what i use the niacinamide one they told me to really really try and say that this is a very good brightening anti dark spot repairing serum and guys to be honest i really do not have anything that has niacinamide as an active ingredient in my skincare routine at the moment okay so they gave me a third serum and this is the vitamin c one and this is an anti anti wrinkle radiance renovating antioxidant so what i'm going to do is maybe when i run out of my pigment clap which is the serum that i currently use on my face i will gradually find ways to incorporate these okay but these are all products that i'm genuinely interested in so i'm going out with my sister um for dinner this night and that will be the last thing that we kind of do we're going to z kitchen and yeah so once i go and we come back from z kitchen that'll probably be the end of this vlog but i hope you guys have enjoyed it so far though okay this is my life okay okay guys um ready I'm wearing this Zara jacket that I've had for like ages, jeans that I got from ASOS. It's a little crop top. I don't know where this is from. But if I remember, I'm going to have it linked. I'm wearing a um, pack slippers. These are the ones from Dubai. And my wife is so bad. So, yeah. I don't know why I feel like. I don't know if I should add more water or put more, something else on this week. But it actually just generally looks nice. So, let us go. Go. <laughs> Every night I'm going on the grid Texting back, I want you Hit you up, I'm on the other side I miss you, miss you Take you off, I came, your way to strong Cannot keep it low-key Got me drugged, your pheromones hit the roof Auto, your taste It's really a bad reception out there Where are you heading? guys i am back home <laughs> i'm so tired like dinner was good dinner was really good and um, the food was good the conversations were good everything was good so nama is leaving very early tomorrow her flight is by 6 50 a.m so she has to leave here like by 4 30 or something i have to wake up i have i'm supposed to go for a march tomorrow morning but i'm not i don't think i'll be able to go to be honest like and I'm not happy about it, but we'll see how it goes. Like, if I start the next vlog with that, then that means I went. If I don't, then yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to me if you're not yet subscribed. I'll see you in my next one.